Welcome to another video from the Brookwood and Deep Cut Junction Railway. This time I'm going to be putting a retaining wall uh, to cover up the uh, woodwork where my track goes over the desk. As you can see from this video here at the moment all the uh, supports are on full display. To do this I've uh, used Metcalf um, products. I found that I couldn't find a, a specific kit for a retaining wall so I decided to get this um, viaduct which I'm adapting to suit the purpose. What I did was take the basic shape of the viaduct, cut out the central parts and just leave me a frame like that. Uh, this is then placed on top of some plain matching brickwork um, and here we are, this is what the end product will broadly look like. I'm having to do all this with one hand because the other hand is holding the camera. I must invest in a tripod. Right now, here's the work desk which is supposed to be nice and tidy and here is the first prototype seems to look all right. I've put the brickwork at the top as well and each one takes um, not more than about 10 minutes to make. And the idea is it stands here against the uh, existing baseboard and gives the effect of the stone wall. I've now started a production line using lots of bulldog clips to hold everything together while it glues. I find these very useful and they're very cheaply available from Tesco and sundry other sources. This is the production line going here. Right, now I've made a few of them and um, I'm gluing them together in sections. At one point the track came too close to the edge and snagged against the retaining wall so I had to put some padding in but um, I think basically that's it here's the finished product and I'll leave you with some trains running to illustrate the effect hope you enjoyed the short video talk to you again soon